we haven't found any particular year difficult. For example, last year was difficult for most global bond managers. I think, yeah, actually for all the assets class, because most of them show negative return. Uh, UBS Dynamic Fund you know, had performed very well 17, 18, and 19. So we're kind of lucky. Investors often you know, trust the central bank was too much. I often said in the team, you know, we have to do our own homework, and the central banks can be wrong, and they can change the mind very quickly. For example, you know, last year, all the way up to early October, the US central bank was very hawkish, want to hike a lot more rates, and then in two weeks' time, it changed. So our portfolio just positioned right on time for that change. It's a great honor for me and for the team and for the firm. So I think it's an uh, extra motivation for us to do better in the future years for our investors. The global dynamic by the name, you know, we have a very dynamic process in terms of duration, country, access class allocation. For the moment, you know, we maintain reasonably low duration. That means we think the valuation for bonds is on the rich side. And uh, secondly, we allocate you know, substantial over, you know, risk budget toward uh, cross-country, cross-asset class investment because there's a you know, significant divergence in monetary policy. For example, last year, the U.S. central bank was hiking rate, where many other central banks were cutting rate. So, you know, this portfolio benefits substantially. And, you know, the high emerging market was, you know, um, hit very hard in the middle of the last year, and by the end of the year, was become very cheap and attractive. The portfolio increased allocation to that. But over the last three to four years, we have reduced allocation to corporate bonds because you know, the spread is very tight and the economic cycle has been very mature. I think that there are three elements. You know, one, we have a very dynamic four-step investment process. Number two, we have a fantastic team supported by you know, specialists around the world. I think number three, we try to stay just ahead of the curve.